Yesterday, Prince Charles and Camilla shared a poignant message on their Instagram reminding people to check in on their older friends and relatives over the Christmas period. The couple, who shared the reminder via the Clarence House Instagram account, said, This Christmas, the Prince of Wales and the Duchess of Cornwall encourage you to remember your older friends and relatives over the festive season. Did you know almost 1.5 million older people feel more lonely at Christmas than any other time of year? The Prince of Wales is a patron of Age UK, a charity that supports older people throughout the UK, while Camilla is patron of the Silver Line, which provides a 24-hour helpline for the elderly. As is royal family tradition, the couple is expected to celebrate Christmas with the Queen in Sandringham this year, alongside other senior royals. However, the Duchess of Cornwall's son, Tom, once sensationally recalled his mother swearing on Christmas morning while kicking the turkey into the oven. This was, of course, before Camilla's 2005 wedding to the heir apparent. Speaking to Town & Country magazine in 2019 Tom said his mother and aunt used to swear at 6 a.m. in the morning. When asked if he would eat turkey at Christmas, as a child the Duchess' son said, I remember, my mother and aunt waking up and kicking a turkey into an agar, which is a sort of always-on English cooking thing that you have in the country. They always made a big deal of it, and sweating away and pushing it and swearing at 6 o'clock in the morning. Tom, who works as a food writer, added, but I personally prefer beef, and I feel a bit guilty with my children that they've never had turkey for Christmas. I thought I deprived them somewhat of something very traditional, but yes, most people have turkey and there are very good turkeys, but give me beef any day. Camilla is unlikely to be the person cooking the turkey since she married into the firm a decade ago. On Christmas Day the Duchess of Cornwall allegedly takes part in the royal family celebrations in Sandringham, before heading down to London to see her children. In 2019, royal commentator Angela Mollard described Camilla's frantic Christmas on Zoe Burrell's Royals podcast. She said, this is interesting, isn't it? It's just like so many pe normal people going about their business, they have a situation where they might be from a blended family or maybe divorced and they have another family. She's Charles's second wife, so what she's doing this year is she's going to the church. She wasn't there last year because she had a really heavy cough. This year she's going to the church and then she'll have lunch, and then after the Queen's speech, which I think is around 3pm she'll make her way down to London. We know this because her son, Tom Parker Bowles, who's a chef and writes cookbooks, has talked about the fact that they'll come down to London, and then she'll spend the evening with her son, her daughter and her grandchildren. Camilla has five grandchildren oh Tom's children Lola and Freddie, and her daughter, Laura Parker Bowles' children, Eliza, Gus and Lou. This year the royal family are still expected to spend Christmas and Sandringham despite a massive surge in coronavirus cases across the UK. The spread of the Omicron variant even led the Queen to cancel a traditional pre-Christmas lunch with members of her extended family.